What is up, ladies and gentlemen? This is Tyler with TarverAcademy.com, and if you could please subscribe, that would be phenomenal. Here we go. Today we're going to learn how to insert and arrange text, shapes, and lines into a Google Slide. So, uh, first thing we're going to do is we're going to go into our Google Slide presentation, and we can start with any slide you want. So let's pretend like it's just completely blank. This one had text already in it, but let's say it's a completely blank slide. Um, so the first thing is up here, if you'll see on this panel, you'll have a little T with a box. That's a text box. So we can click that, and that is going to allow us to hover over our slide with the little plus sign. We click and drag, depending on how big we want our text box to be, and then we can start typing. This is my text box. It's great. Okay. Another way to add a text box would be to go to uh, insert text box. So they've put it in two places. They try to put uh, with Google, they try to put things where you would um, essentially everywhere the top two or three places you would think it would need to be if you wanted to do it, but you know, factoring in other people's opinions on where it should be. And that's where they put it. So another one, another one. It's up song I think okay I know I left the a out it's because of the song okay so that's text let's talk about adding in shapes so if you go two over see these little guys it's a circle and a square or quadrilateral we don't know how long the other two sides are so we're gonna go over here click on that and it allows us to choose from a list of shapes arrows call outs which is like uh, your Batman BAM WHAM SMACK all that stuff uh, and then equations we can put that in there so if you're a math teacher boom let's toss that in See, we got an equal sign. That's cute. Let's add a um, quadrilateral. There we go. Look at that. Now, once you're in there, you can choose. Um, like, look up. Watch this right here as I click on and off of the shape. You see those colors? I'm on it, off it, on it, off it. That means I can choose the fill, which I can make transparent, and I can make the line solid black. Boom. There we go. And I can always, to arrange these, I can just click and drag them around. For shapes, it's easy. Just click anywhere on the shape or on the corner of the box. Oh, no. Nope. Or on this little circle right here. That's going to turn it. I apologize. So you're going to click on the box and drag it. For these, for the text box, to arrange them, you click on the exterior. See the line? The line around it, that rectangle? You click that and drag it. You can move it wherever you want. Okay? Um, if you'll notice right here, you see how that's over the top of it? If you want, like Sylvester Stallone, remember that? <laughs> Just kidding. Okay, so we want to move that to the back. I can right click, and then I can go to order, and then I can push it to the back. And that will put my text over the top of it. Okay, and let's see what else. It was that, that, and a line. Let's talk about adding lines. So over here, next to the shapes, click that. I can choose which kind of line I want. Let's go with a basic line. I just do this, drag it to where I want, and it's gonna make a line. I just selected everything, sorry. It's my first time, just kidding. Here we go. Pew. Add a line, there we go. Sorry guys. All right, boom, there you go. You got a line. You can arrange that by clicking on it, moving it around. You can adjust this. There you go. You just learned how to create texts, shapes, and lines, and arrange them. Thank you guys so much, have a great day. And never stop learning. Please subscribe. The end. Hey, what's up? Thank you so much for watching my training video. If that helped at all, please subscribe to this channel. It's free, costs nothing. Just click the little red subscribe button unless they change the color. Hey, also, if you want me to come to your school and help train your teachers or your administrators or your students and help make your life easier with Google, just let me know. I've got links in the bio on how to get a hold of me. DM me at Tyler Tarver on Instagram or Twitter. You can go hit my email, tylertarver at gmail.com. Um, or you can just yell really loud. Maybe I'm close. Oh, I thought I heard somebody. You want me to come training on Google? No? Okay. It'll be fun. We'll learn a lot. And I'll give you a bunch of resources. So, thank you guys. Hey, did you subscribe? We talked about it earlier. No pressure. But if you want to, I'll be here. I'm just going to wait right here. Look at this lighting. Oh, wow.